Oprah Winfrey, an incredibly successful American media executive, talk show host, producer, and philanthropist, teaches us that no matter how much of a challenging start we have in life, it has no bearing on how we finish. Here are three quick but really powerful lessons we can all learn from her. Forgive yourself. Everyone makes mistakes. There is no exception. But how we move on makes a big difference. While it is okay to feel guilty, if we carry it too long, it can begin to alter our perception of ourselves and take a significant toll on our confidence and mental health. That's why it's important to forgive ourselves as soon as possible. Don't be a hostage to your past experiences, decisions, or choices, because you are not the person you were five, 10, 20, or more years ago. So don't be so hard on yourself about your past mistakes. You made them because you didn't know any better. Instead of drowning in guilt, regret, and shame, look at those past mistakes as opportunities and be grateful for the lessons they provided you. Don't fear failure. Most of us know that failure is a reality of life, and at some level, we even understand that it can actually help us grow. Yet, we hate to fail. We fear it, we dread it, we try to avoid it, and when it does happen, we hold on to it. We give it power and allow it to dictate our way forward. However, obsessing over failure will not change the outcome. And the truth is, no great success was ever achieved without failure. So whether we like it or not, there is no success without failure. And the quicker we deal with failure, the quicker we are ready for success. So keep in mind that failure is only a delay, not a defeat. Failure is a temporary detour, not a dead-end street. Just because you failed today or yesterday doesn't mean that you will fail the next time. If you screwed up, don't let that be your excuse to give up. Let your screw-up be your motivation to try once again. Each setback presents a chance for you to grow. Your only job is to find the opportunity in your failure and turn it into a positive lesson. Some of the best lessons you can learn throughout your life will come from your failure rather than your success. So from now on, instead of allowing failure to be a dark moment in your history, let it be a measure of progress. From now on, view failure as a critical enabler of your success, as a great motivator, a teacher, a stepping stone along your path to greatness. Never stop improving. We all want to enjoy a life that is full of bliss and joy. We want to be healthy, wealthy, and successful. But we also like our comfortable lifestyles and just do what we are used to doing and stay within the confines of least resistance. However, if we want to make progress in life and become better versions of ourselves, we need to break free. Good things don't happen to us because we want them to, especially if we are the same as we used to be. They happen to us when we take action, when we try to improve when we are trying to be better. You can't expect to evolve and reach new heights if you only stick to your normal habits and routine lifestyle. You need to be improving continuously if you want to get ahead. Whatever your personal definition of success, you won't achieve it if you always shy away from making a move. If you want to win in life, you have to improve yourself. You have to be a better version of yourself where you will stand and what new things you will be capable of doing tomorrow will largely depend on what you do to improve yourself today. So invest in yourself. 
your future depends on.